Hi, this is Sean from Martell's Coins, and today we're going to talk about GSA Morgan Dollars. Today we're going to be talking about some Morgan Dollars, or GSA Morgan Dollars, specifically the Carson Cities that I recently picked up over the counter at the shop. Um, a little bit of history of the GSA Dollars. Um, there was a hoard of Morgan dollars found. Um, there was almost 3 million coins and then 95% of them was uh, CC's. Um, they had 78 CC, 79 CC, and 80 through 85 CC and also 90, 91 CC. Um, 82 to 84 is most common that you'll see in the CC Morgan dollars. Um, 80, 81 is a little bit less common and then you know 79 CC is very rare so it's a 90, 91 CC. Um, so we can go look through this group and see what we came up with. Our first one was is an 84 cc, and usually they come with a black box with paperwork. Um, I've got some paperwork here, work. I'll show you what it looks like. But those are the original boxes that they came in that they auctioned off for people that they can buy. First up is an 84 cc. As you can see, the majority of them were uncirculated. They came out. Nice back luster to them. Sometimes they come with toning or heavy bag marks, but this one's actually pretty nice for an 84. Next up, we have this a little stuck in here. Got that one. 83 cc. A little bit of edge toning on the bottom. And sometimes these came really dark toning or white. The majority of them were white that came out. I'm assuming more of the bags that were unsealed or you know pressed against the, the burlap of the bag once became toned. This one, this is what the paperwork looks like that they originally came in. And with the serial numbers, the first two digits. 83 tells you which one, what year it was. So this is, would be an 83 CC that was in this package. This is what the 83 CC looks like. Again, a little bit of edge toning. Very nice back. Amazing cartwheel luster on these. Next one we have, this is an 82 cc, so like they're showing you before, the 82, 83, 84 are the common day ones. This one's got some toning to it. A little bit right here, you can see a little bit of PL uh, um, feels to it, which is nice. Next, we have a little bit rarer one. This is an 81cc. It usually comes box of papers, but when I bought it, you know, the customer didn't have a box of papers, but very nice 80cc. The back is very, very nice. Front's got a little bit marks on the cheeks but other than that's a nice uncirculated 81 cc and for like for instance you know the original numbers that were found um 82 to 84 cc was anywhere from 600 to 900 thousand that were found um where the 80 81 was only you know 80 cc is around 130 thousand and 81 cc was 140 thousand Next, we have another 82 cc. Sometimes, there you go. An 82 cc. Again, a very nice coin, nicely uncirculated.
And a couple of these I will get graded. Normally, this stuff you would grade it by NGC. NGC. And if you've ever seen before, they got a sticker on the bottom and it'll tell you what grade it is. They actually keep it inside the black original case, which is nice. And the last one we have is an ADCC. And it's really actually nice compared to other ADCC GSAs that I've seen in the past. It's got a nice PL um, feel to it. Pretty clean chic for a CC Morgan dollar. And the back is absolutely gorgeous. So I got that's all I got to show you today. I was just showing you a little bit of what the GSA looks like. Um, Always, too, if you ever buy a GSA, you want to keep it with the original box and papers and in this plastic holder because there is a slight premium for having it in the original packaging for GSAs. Um, if you like this video, please like it, or you can comment below with questions or anything that you would like, and always please subscribe. Thank you.